in order to create a Slack integration where you can send notifications through a Slack webhook, you will need to set up a few things on Slack's end. Once clicking on the view Slack documentation, you will come to the following page. You will go to the Slack documentation where you will get explanation on how to send messages using incoming webhooks. The first thing you will need is to create an app to enable the webhook on. It's really simple to create your app. Just press the button. From here, you will be able to create your app either from scratch or from an app manifest. Let's create one from scratch. We will give it an app name and then you will be able to pick your workspace to develop your app in. Once done, just press create app. And from here, you will come into the basic information of your app. If we scroll down a little bit, you will see that we have incoming webhooks. And from here, we will be able to create our webhook. Just press the incoming webhooks tab. From here, enable incoming webhooks. If we scroll down now, we can add a new webhook towards your app. And now we can add a new webhook towards the workspace. If we press it, and now you will see an overview of chatbot notifications. In this case, this is the app that we created. It's requesting permissions to access the Slack workspace. And now we need to enable a certain channel inside that workspace to enable the webhook on. Just select one from the dropdown. And once done, just press allow. Now that you created your webhook, if we scroll down onto this page, you will see that your webhook URL is posted right here. Just copy the webhook, go inside of your platform integration, paste the webhook, and you can give it any app icon that you like to, along with the app name. Once done, press create. Once successful, you will see your webhook URL inside of your webhook URL overview. In a later video, we will show you how you can send notifications through your chatbot by using the Flow Builder.